Show it to your phone. <laughs> Show how cute it is. Yay! <laughs> this is what she got in London, by the way. This is what what she got instead of a jelly cat. It's actually quite heavy. She's always carrying it around. Get out of here! Go on, clear her off. Go on, get out. Get. This is Pusheen. Best plushie. You are knocking everything. <laughs> off. Pop it. Off your pop. Go on. Okay. Clear off. So, I just recorded a jelly cat video, so if you're interested, that should be up first. But I also have a Plushy Dreadfuls unboxing to record today. I've had one of these waiting for ages. I can't remember which one it is now, though. Do I have dates on here or anything? I think I've had this one longer. Let's, open, let's start with the one I've had longest, I think. At least I think. <laughs> let's crack into it. I'm going to have to use scissors. Because I you can't see anything, right? But yeah, I'm going to have to use scissors to crack into this, so... I am over the days of trying to rip these bags open. <laughs> okay. Oh, good. You can't see when it rolls over like that. Yes. So this is the one I've had longest. Okay. I got numb. I got numb, bunny. Okay. So Pushy Dead Fools announced a while ago that they were going to be releasing some pens. And they said that they'll randomly put them in people's parcels. And I got one. I'm really happy. Let me get it out. Okay, so there's like a little rubbery little topper on there. And it says plushy dreadfuls. I got Num Bunny, which is actually a plushy I don't have. But I love this pen. I love stationery. I'm going to be using this. That's for sure. Okay, so let's get into the bunny though. And by the way, thank you, plushy dreadfuls. If you see this video, thank you. I, I appreciate this. I like this a lot. I like freebies. Just saying. I, I, I like them. So I completed my collection of anxiety bunnies. This one, for some reason, has a completely different bag to the others. I mean, I guess the other three have a different bag to the original one. And then this one has a different bag as well. I love this bag, though. This bag is, like, really cool. I've got anxiety and I want to go home. <laughs> and then on the back, it has some words. It says, anxiety, I want to go home. So it has the same thing, but it's kind of, like, written around as if someone's, like, manically written it on a wall. Like in a horror movie or something. I love this black with orange. That's really cool. I prefer the little worry buns being orange than the bunny itself. Let's get out the bun. Oh, I'm really glad they went with the grey ears because when they first showed it, they showed one that had it was black all over. And I think I commented saying it'd be nice if the ears weren't quite the same because it was really hard to see. Also, I thought the eyes were a bit too dark, but um, in real life, you can see the eyes a lot better than you could on that picture. So I don't know if they've changed that slightly as well, the shade of black feels really soft do they all feel this soft am i am i just like extra sensory today because i feel like everything i've got out well not everything but i got some smudge um jelly cats and they're like insanely soft i gotta try and dig out my anxiety bunnies i'm gonna destroy my arrangement yeah destroyed again i'm always destroying my arrangement oh i'm sorry dragons i'm sorry guys okay so i have the full set now I have black, I have orange, I have yellow, blue, although in my mind he's teal, and purple. I have everyone! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. That is crazy. That's a lot of anxiety. But I have a lot of anxiety, so that makes sense. Um, Let me open up the black one. Oh, he's got a bit of a loose thread on the back of him. I'll just cut that off though. Let's have a look at his worry buns. Yep, one. And tea. I always have to check if I've got tea now after I had one missing that one time. And they're so cute. They remind me of gremlins, you know. <laughs> they do remind me of gremlins a little bit. Love them. Is this little tag different? No, they've, they've all got a little love heart. This love heart is, is, seems bigger. The little the zipper pull is a little bit bigger than the silver ones that are on these. 
and they're very tiny what's the orange one like yeah they're the same the orange one is the same did i put both of them in there or did i only put one in there no they're both in there <laughs> their pouches are definitely bigger than the original orange one the original or orange one is a very uh tight squeeze and here is the black zipper pull it's hard to see but it is slightly bigger than the silver ones and yet yeah, his magnets on his face clearly work he's come with them on his face already so that is the black anxiety one <laughs> so that is all of those um i'm gonna have to completely rearrange this whole area again i should have thought this through before i started unboxing because i knew i had him and that i'd want to show off all of them i do tend to bury the orange one quite a lot now because i don't need to see him anymore because he's a uh, he is kind of a, you know, he's, he's just, I don't know, he's a stressful colour. <laughs> he gives me anxiety, but yeah. I love that I have the whole collection. And this bag is really cool. I love the bag. Now, I have another one here. This one I'm really, really excited about. It's actually one of my favourite one, well, favourite designs that I've seen. And I really hope it's just as good in person. And I have every faith it will be because I am very rarely disappointed in Pushy Dreadfuls. Have I been disappointed in one before? I don't think so. I've had some like with issues and stuff, but I don't think I've ever been dis disappointed with its design. So, and Pushy Dreadfuls have always been really good at helping me fix any issues I've ever had. So, and I've not had many. I had one anxiety bunny that had one worry bunny with it. And I had my fawn response bunny who had an issue. And other than that, I've had no problem. Oh, I've got another pen, but I also got, it's another num bunny. <laughs> so I got the same pen twice. That's okay. So when one runs out, I have another one. But yeah, another num bunny. I will be using them as well. Now, this bunny is the masking bunny. I love this one. I know some people are a bit weirded out because it's like clowny, but I love it. I love it. I'm not weirded out by clowns, I guess. I'm not bothered by them. I do actually have a full-on clown plush somewhere. I had it since I was really little. My auntie bought it for me, but I don't know where he is. So here is the bag for the masking bunny. He's wearing his happy mask. He's on stage. And then this is the back. Okay, let's get him up. I'm so excited to see him. I think he looks so much cuter without his masks on, so I will be keeping him maskless. I just love his little face. Oh my God. And his ears are so pretty. Oh my God. So here he is. And then here's one ear. It's like pink and yellow tie dye. And then the other ear is it's like more just yellow. Yellow and a little bit of blue tie dye. I'm guessing that all of the masking bunnies are going to be quite unique when it comes to the insides of their ears. This is just how my one has come. I just love him. Look at that face. I love him. I love how he looks kind of like numb. I know that sounds weird, but I love him. And he's got little buttons there, actually, like shiny. They're not embroidered or anything. They're like plastic. Oh my God, I love him. I really do love him. I've been so excited about this one to be released. Oh, and he's got like the kind of facial expression on his ear. You get this mask, you have this mask. This is a creepy mask. I'm not gonna lie, this, is, this mask is creepy, but I like it. I like creepy, so. And then you have this one. This is the cute mask. I like this one. I'm gonna try the masks on, but he will not be staying in these masks. He will be maskless. So there he is with the love heart mask on. I'm not very good at putting these masks on my bunnies, I don't think. I always get them on slightly wonky. So there's that one. Then we're gonna go with the creepy, like, this reminds me of that troll image, like the, the picture you have for like being a troll. I'm not gonna worry about putting his ears out. But... <laughs> okay, that's funny. It's creepy when it's not on him, but it's funny when it's on. Oh my god! <laughs> I, I actually like it. I like it. I like it a lot. That's so. F that's funny. That's funny. Okay, okay, I, I, like, I, um, I could play with that for a while, that's funny. Okay, and then we have the final mask. Let's put this one on. I said I wasn't going to sort the ears out, but I had to in the end of that one. That was just so... F oh, my God. Cracked me up. That tickled my pickle. Right, and then here's this one. This one is a lot less amusing now. I should have done this one first. <laughs> the others are great. I love them. I still don't think I'll be making him wear them because it's just another thing that's going to fall off into my bed and get lost. But, like, for shiggles this one oh i did not think i would enjoy this one so much oh they're like little pockets I got that. you could put stuff in these that's fun <laughs> that amused me that really did amuse me i'm gonna hang these up probably with the other masks i have for ptsd bunny that really tickled me oh my god anyway 
I'm gonna leave this here. Both the videos I recorded today are quite long, and I've got, got I've got a lot of editing to do. So today in this unboxing, I completed my anxiety bunny set, and I got the masking bunny, which I've been so excited for. Like I say, I've been the second I saw the design for it when it was just a drawing, I was like this this all day long and people were trying to get him to change the design i was like no 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 i want him like this i even i think i even commented saying like if you do change the design can i buy the pro like the promo version of it because i the prototype because i i wanted it like this i think he's designed perfectly for masking oh i love him this is what i have today i do have two more on the way okay so i didn't notice this at first they've put new tags on them so it actually tells you the symbolism now because I, I often forget what some of the symbolism is but yeah this one says it's got removable mask cga color palette and falsetto suit and then on this side it's got like a cute picture of the bunny that you got so we have the same thing on the black on anxiety bunny as well pretty cool i am trying to get to 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year so if you have made it this far maybe consider giving me a subscribe if not maybe just drop me a comment or um give me a like and that will help me out in the algorithm as well and i am a very small channel at the moment i haven't got names really for most of my plush dreadfuls and i was thinking that i'll go through who needs names who doesn't need them i'll do a collection video which should be coming probably next month that's what i'm hoping so yeah please show me some love below maybe like i say comment or like would just be fine like i appreciate any help you're willing to give me and thank you so much for watching and i will see you again soon